Equifax, one of America's largest credit bureaus and reporting agencies, recently suffered one of the largest cybersecurity attacks in, in recent history. Over 143 million records were lost. These were record. These records contained social security numbers, email addresses, uh, home addresses, and other details about individuals. This was about one third of the American population. Now. Uh, speculation is out there of what caused the breach. Uh, a lot of fingers are being pointed at a web application, uh, a Java web application framework called Apache Struts, uh, which is extremely popular within the enterprise. Now, web applications that are built today, about 70% of the code uses third-party uh, frameworks and libraries like Apache Struts, and only about 30% is really in-house built, developed code. So the importance and the reliance of these third-party frameworks is becoming more and more and more important. Now, you know, we're not here to blame Equifax or put extra pressure or, or, or extra eyes on, on, on them. We understand that security is an extremely hard thing uh, to accomplish, especially in a, an organization that size. Now, um, there are things that um, we can do to protect ourselves from issues like this, and we're going to talk a little bit more about that uh, in, in future segments. But right now, uh, again, it looks like there's a couple of Apache struts vulnerabilities out there that there are patches for, uh, and, may, and uh, Equifax may have been uh, slow applying those patches in, and, uh, to their production environment.